Hey everybody, it's Corleone from Lightcast Studios. Welcome to today's unboxing. Today we will be unboxing the Bamboo Splash. And I don't know why it says pen at the bottom, but it does come with a tablet. So I've heard a lot of good reviews about this uh, product. And on the back, as you can see, here's some uh, little perks and uh, programs that comes with the program. Uh, the start part talks about how you can use it on your computer and it's compatible with everything. Um, very natural, thanks to Bamboo, blah, 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 blah. And your computer come together. It's a must have. Explorer, just getting started. You can use it to write out of the box. Artrageous talks about the programs, the Artrage 3 Studio and Autodesk Sketchbook Express programs. And Ergo talks about how it has the most natural feeling pen um, over a natural mouse or a um, traditional mouse. Uh, on the side, there's pretty much nothing else except for the packaging details. On the front, it talks about uh, let your imagination run wild with, with the Art Rage and Sketchbook Express programs. And that's pretty much it for uh, that. I don't really have anything else to talk about in, on the actual package itself, but let's get into the package. I have to get my pen or my. Um, it's like I have to get my key to open up the, <laughs> the package because I don't have anything else to open it up, but it works just fine anyway. It's actually a really light package, and I've heard a lot of good reviews about this, how it's uh, really simple to use. You just plug it in, install the software, and you're ready to go. Um, uh, the only drawback I heard was talking about how uh, you have to use like a glove or something to protect your hand from uh, actually touching the tablet itself, or else the mouse would just go crazy. So what I recommend doing is for people to get gloves and or getting a, um, a sticky note in order to draw with. As you can see, right on right out of the package, the tablet is in the front, but uh, we're just going to talk about that later. It looks really cool, but uh, let's get to the other stuff inside the package, which is the pen, as you can see right away. It looks, it looks kind of fat, but actually it feels very, very nice. It has a matte finish, so when you're holding it, it feels like a mechanical pencil or holding similar to an eraser. And it has a little button on the side just for your uh, right-click button. Uh, in order for you to um, do other things besides this drawing. Um, I heard the uh, the benefits of having the Wacom Bamboo tablet um, pens are, and the tablet itself allows you to um, use print pressure sensitivity um, drawing, which allows you to, depending on how hard you press on the actual tablet itself, it'll draw accordingly with the programs. As you can see, it comes with extra nubs, so if you ever lose one, you can always replace them. And on the back, just has a little cover for the back part. Nothing big about the back. It's in the fact that it matches the tablet itself. Getting to the package right here, which is just has a nice little bamboo on it. Um, as you can see on the front, talks about plugging into your computer, opening the software, and plugging into your, plugging your um, tablet in and installing it. Um, and then on the inside, there's a bunch of little cool stuff, which is the quick start guide. Really self-explanatory. Uh, the quick start, which talks about um, how to use your bamboo, welcome to your bamboo, things like that. The installation CD, as you can see here, and also the uh, program uh, software bundle, which allows you to um, run Autodesk, Sketchbook Express, Evernote, Bamboo Paper, and Artridge Studio 3.5. And uh, let's just put that to the side over there. The only other thing that I would see in the package would actually be the uh, USB uh, plug, which Let's just put that back right now, which would be the, uh, you know, it's really simple. You just plug that into the tablet right here, the mini USB, and then the uh, USB part into your computer, and you that allows you to run the program. You can use that. I think it, it looks kind of proprietary, but I highly doubt that because I've seen that kind of plug for my phone and uh, my BlackBerry phone. That's it in the package. As you can see, it just comes with the software stuff and manuals, the USB, and the pen with the extra nubs. Getting to the Wacom Bamboo um, tablet itself, it's very light, and let me just take this tape off first. Pulling it out of the package, as you can see, we have a very light, really nice matte finish on the tablet itself, matches the pen and the style. It feels like paper, um, even when you're holding it with your hand. As you can see on the top, it has the mini USB plug where you have to have it keeping, you have to keep it plugged in onto um, the USB in order for you to use the tablet. It's not wireless, so that's that's something else, but I enjoy um, still having it otherwise. It is $66, or when I bought it, it was $60 um, to $70, so 
on the top here you have the or in the middle you have the LED with indicator which tells you if the um, tablet is on and when you put the pen on it it feels like you're drawing on paper using charcoal or similarly a colored pencil so I like that a lot uh, on the back just some uh, model details and things like that and on the top um, of the actual tablet has the little um, cloth um, tag that says bamboo and you can hold it from there and attach things to it and make it look kind of cool that's pretty much it for that for that package um, I don't know what else to talk about with it but um, again I said you have to use uh, gloves and things like that in order for you to um, protect your hand from touching it unless you like drawing with your hand not touching the tablet but that's kind of unnatural to me other than that that's pretty much it for the uh, Wacom Bamboo Splash if you guys have any questions please please leave them in the comments below um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to comment subscribe and until next time this is Lightcast Studios and thanks for watching